Good evening, everyone. There is a war coming, Mama said. One that wouldn't require guns and mobs, it would be a call of duty to serve man and God, to serve a woman and God, and to still pledge my allegiance with no room for treachery. She said, when I decide to conspire with the enemy, I lose the war at both ends. She said, when my father married his second and his third and his fourth, it was like he took off his bloodproof vest and now he's not immune to the rampage of shots that come at him in this civil war. She said, boy. She said, boy. She said, Kay. She said, Kay. Wear your bloodproof vest because you can never be sure where the next stray bullet will come at you. For once the Ayiridi dies down, the next sounds you are going to be hearing is pa. Gas don't finish. Ga. Who be that girl where they always call you? You must get your weapons of mass communications ready to deliver manifestos and, and, uh, manifestos and propaganda. There is a war coming. My mama said there is war coming. So avoid falling a victim of this battlefield because wear your boots fly kick and trample every bed that whistles whisperings and agendas in your household like Nagamujin Kirota Abakilai. Lend the power of Naira, of sweet lines, of melodies of Kyota de Kyota Tawa, of making a grown woman feel like a 16 year old all over again, of Zanche, of making butterflies, make gardens flourish in her stomach. My mama said, You have to know all this, son, because there is a war coming. To win this war, you must be willing to update your arsenal. How can you fight a war with dagger sticks and stones when you can expand your potentials to fly jets, activate drones, and make missiles track to the door of an enemy? Write sweet words and send them as letter bomb. Let her heart explode with the joy that will get her in a Stockholm syndrome. In this war, no one is to be trusted. So you must not discuss your war tactics with any soldier except that one person. For one leakage will lead to an ambush. You are continuously losing the war. In this war, you have to know that you need to fondle with all her checkpoints, the exact way you fondle with the trigger, because that will trigger her in all the parts of her that trickle and drip in rising cooperation. This war is not a one-man parade. You and her must collaborate in marching forward till you meet at the point of ecstasy. You must learn to be a sniper. Blend yourself into all situations and get shot when they least expect it. This war is variety. Shinkafa de Talia. It is sweetness like cuddling the Safia. It is togetherness like Eurina Tsinsia. Mama emphasized it needs patience of Uri de Juria. Remember that if other methods do not work, cannibalism is also a valid weapon. Come along with 69 small chops. Eat and be eaten. After this, I realized that despite my ignorance of thinking that this war is about love, ice cream dates, PDAs, honeymoons, and all the berry blasts of an infant relationship. I, I choose to stand on my honor. I summon the courage to be ready to jump every mountain, cross every sea to sea, to paddle through the enemy's enclave, to be dragged through the mud, to lose consciousness, to be drunk in the adrenaline of magazines, to find solace in my comrades, all in the beat and effort to win this war, because there is no room for losing. Mama sipped from her cup, looked up at me and said, there is a war coming. Thank you very much.